Capricorn, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for April 7th until 13th. Let's take a look what's in store for you this week. Walk away from a situation that's been like driving into loneliness and isolation. You are wishing for some things in your life right now that you can't, that you don't have any control. Yet you are wishing for some things to change. However, there will be a wave of, ab <laughs> of abundance and prosperity that will be coming your way. And you will be very thankful for all the hard works that you've been doing. Even though you're uh, feeling a little bit uh, sleazy and uh, procrastinating for the past few days. And there's also somebody who's younger than you that will be disappointing you because of the sudden change that they are showing. Now, you are wishing for some more positive things to come your way and you're aiming for more and more and more. For the past few days and weeks that you've been thinking, where is my life should go? You know where you should be going, but you want to steer it into a much clearer horizon. So this week, you will be making a lot more targets and goals, and you will be redoing your, you know, your, um, your vision board. Okay? And money is surely going to be coming to you, that despite of all the ordeals that you're going through, emotional turmoils, dramas, and toxic people that surrounding you, you will still be concentrating into your own success and into your own potential, which is good. Now, you will try to pull out some more strength, you know, to create more of a blueprint of your, of your future. And whether you're going to be with someone or not, you are ready for the unknown. And you are ready for more changes, whether it's going to be positive or negative. You know that life will be full of ups and downs and you're open to this. Because there is nothing that you cannot conquer, you know, at this point. Because you've already been through a lot of ordeals and gone through hell and back. And you know how it is. You've already fought a lot of giant problems and, you know, broken a lot of boulders that uh, that stood your way in the past and there's nothing that can stop you and you are not born to be um to be distracted okay you're indestructible you are very resilient okay and in fact that right after getting hurt you become even stronger and smarter that is you know what you're made of Changes will also be coming your way because there is a very good news about money that you have been anticipating and, uh, and uh, waiting. Coming from a water sign person or a water sign man. Now, the only thing here is someone has been acting so cold and distant and cut off and dry with just a younger fire sign around you. And you're wishing for this person to just be cut off your life and just move on. <coughs> you are now also open and ready. That if there are some new changes coming your way, and if you have to go solo at this point, you're ready. Okay? Now, there will be some more um, work related or project related communications, correspondences, inquiries, and you will be dealing with three people, okay, that will be making some um, contracts, business deals. Or will be, you know, taking your service until the end of this year. But then somehow with the changes that is about to come your way, you will have a hard time balancing your personal life and your workplace. Or your, sorry, your work life. Now, if you are currently with an air sign, you will start thinking, so what's going to happen with this person if I'll go? Because you know with the place that you have to go and that you have to travel, they cannot follow you or they cannot be with you. And this is the toughest situation that you're going to be into because there are some children or there are some people that's going to be at stake or that's going to be like involved. Okay. Now, if you will try and talk to this person about your plans, they're not going to listen to you. They are not even going to help you out. 
so there will be a heartbreak and there is also somebody from the past which is another fire sign that you're still thinking about and when you travel there is a possibility that you will be meeting or seeing this person again I feel like this is just part of your closure and once you turn your back the person that you're with right now will be making a big disaster it will be betraying you and you pretty much well know about this you're going to be you know you're very well aware of that how they are capable of doing these things and you're also ready to make some you know um wave of changes just to eliminate this person out of your life because you're feeling so intoxicated and suffocated with you know with the things that this person has been putting you through and you're just really really tired of it so this week you are gonna be making a very tough choice between your work and your personal life that you feel like if this person is really my soulmate or if this person is really the right one for me how come that I have to struggle every now and then in pulling out my real personality and I have to fight for my own self so that I won't be losing myself you know those are the things that you'll be telling yourself and there will be success that's going to be coming your way that despite of you being so successful in your chosen endeavor or career th there are some toxic people that will try to pull you down because of their insecurities and because of their jealousy and you just need to get used to this because you know you've been dealing with a lot of betrayals and jealousy politics you know toxic people all your life and this is nothing new and if you are waiting for you know for something to come new or clean into your life um, I feel like it's gonna take some time for you to really find somebody who's very healthy okay healthy to be with and healthy to uh, to love as well with no baggages or whatsoever so you will know what to do Capricorn and you will know which path to say to take and um, you are not going to give up anything about your success right now just because of somebody who's been feeling so jealous and insecure. All right. Anyway, that's it for you for this week, Capricorn. If you want to talk to me live on the phone and live the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.